Power substations contain high-voltage electrical equipment, transformers, circuit breakers, and other components that pose serious hazards if not properly controlled during maintenance. Loto Lockout Tagout is a critical safety procedure that ensures workers are protected from accidental energy releases while servicing electrical systems. Loto is a systematic process used to de-energize, lock, and tag electrical equipment before maintenance or repair. It prevents accidental activation of high-voltage systems, reducing the risk of electrocution, arc flashes, and other hazards. Why is Loto important in substations, prevents electrical accidents, protects workers from unexpected energization? Avoids arc flash incidents, reduces the risk of severe burns and fatalities, ensures compliance, meets safety regulations like OSHA 1910.147 and NFPA 70E, protects equipment, prevents damage due to unintended power surges, enhances safety culture, encourages responsible work practices. Key steps of LOTO in a power substation, prepare for shutdown, identify all energy sources e.g. transformers, circuit breakers. Isolate the equipment. Open disconnect switches and breakers to cut power. Lock and tag. Apply physical locks and warning tags to prevent re-energization. Release stored energy, discharge capacitors, residual voltage, and trapped energy. Verify isolation. Use voltage testers to confirm zero energy presence. Perform the task. Safely conduct maintenance or repairs. Remove loto devices. Only after ensuring safety and notifying all personnel. A life-saving practice in electrical safety. Power substations operate with high-voltage electricity, making LOTO procedures essential for worker protection. Proper training, awareness, and enforcement ensure a safe working environment, preventing electrical hazards and fatalities. Lockout-tagout LOTO procedures in power stations are essential for ensuring worker safety and compliance with regulations. Each piece of equipment has unique energy sources, requiring clear, documented procedures to prevent accidental energization. Using high-quality lockout devices such as padlocks and circuit breaker lockouts ensures effective isolation of hazardous energy. Given the presence of multiple energy types electrical, mechanical, hydraulic, and thermal proper identification and isolation are crucial. For large-scale maintenance, group lockout systems help protect multiple workers. Regular training, audits, and inspections reinforce best practices in compliance with OSHA 1910.147, 1910.269, and 1910.333. Before work begins, verification of isolation using voltage testers is necessary, along with addressing stored energy risks like capacitor charges. A centralized LOTO station ensures easy access to essential tools, while fostering a strong safety culture and communication prevents misunderstandings and enhances workplace safety. Implementing these practices minimizes risks and ensures a secure working environment in power stations.